Well, I might do. Well, good. I've been on the pill for so long. I'm probably sterile. Listen, when Andrew was six months, I didn't get pregnant. But I lost it because I was so tired looking at a fucking baby. baby. Yes, I did tell you. And well, the doctor I forgot. Had, I sat down with my feet up all day and kept it. And that's the only chance I, had, I ever had. Okay, okay you interested? Did you tell you about it? Oh no, I won't because this is boring. It wasn't a problem at all. Jeez. I don't like messing up my blood. And what a bad time we all had. It's coming now. Good. You also one of the biggest flops in the world. I see. And completely unreliable. Is that it? Undependable. It's that so? You are unappreciative, irresponsible, and indescribably inefficient. What is that? An Albasom? Alright, that's it. I'm finished. Now you've been told off. How do you like that? Good. Now sit down because I'm gonna tell you off. For eight months, I've lived in this apartment all alone. Hey! All alone. I thought I was miserable. I thought I was lonely. And you know what? After I took you in because I thought we could help each other. And after three months, three months of close personal contact, I have if shingles and the heartbreak of psoriasis. You know, I'm just trying to get you to fight for your shitty life, Emily. And you won't do it. I'm your shitty life. Ow! Oh my god. I'm sorry. Ow. Not. Wow, nice hit. Uh, you know, I'm glad to see that you still got a little bit of spark in you. I knew that Aunt Annie was in there somewhere. And you think? You're ready to hear a little story about a girl named Megan who didn't have such a good time in high school. Yeah, I'm referring to myself when you say Megan. It's me, Megan! I know you look at me now and think, boy, she was crazy through high school. Not the case, Annie. This wasn't easy going up and down the halls with. They used to try to blow me up. You know, people used to throw a firecracker on my head during high school. Firecracker, ritually and figuratively. They called me freak. And you think I let that stop me? You think I went home crying to my mommy? Oh, I don't have any friend, what should I do? <laughs> no, I did not. <laughs> well, as you probably didn't notice with your untrained person eyes, this. $4.4 million pieces of private artwork who first immersed mind of the artist while he bathed in the organic milk and the untouched lagoon of the bay. And the artist brings the divine access to the viewer by interdimensionally depicting the sacramental soul once of through the journey of otherworldly needs and mastery inventiveness. Are you following? I don't care. Furthermore, beyond what can be seen here is the complementary composition in which the figurative movement is applied by the way of plastic technique curated by the artist himself. Specifically, the malleable movements. As you can see here, 